Hi there, I'm Beetlejuice from Brown's Wicked Edge and welcome to day six of the cartridge, uh, the, sorry, the triple blade cartridge test. Um, this is one of two that have been highly requested and this is just a bit of water. I'm also just out of the shower by the way for those of you who are wondering about what my prep looks like. So I've been well scrubbed and hydrated from the shower. So, after a couple of days of trying a couple of different techniques, I had to take yesterday off because of accumulated damage from uh, multi-pass attempts with the razor and uh, I'm trying to be as fair and empirical as I can here in what arguably is a fairly subjective test. Um, for those of you who might be wondering, is this, you know, the definitive, you know, cartridge versus uh, other shaving types. Mm. If it works for you, it works for you. But this is what works for me and this is how it's working so far. Yeah. So, the big question that we always get is, is this superior to this? So, what I'm going to do so I'm going to do a single pass with this and rinse the razor normally. I'm going to do a single pass in the same direction afterwards, pretty lathering of course, with this, which is a Mercure Future by the way, and that is set to 3, which is my standard setting. When I'm done with that, I'm going to rinse in this container of water. So if this actually does shave more, then the standard cartridge razor, you'll be able to see the debris in the bottom. Um, is it definitive? No. But it's also being done slightly off camera, so you will have to trust me that this is indeed um, above board. I, of course, have no interest and in no real. Uh, incentive to cheat here. I am, and I've not done this before either by the way, so the results will be a fair surprise to me as well. Okay, so let's have a look. Still tugs. Oh, I'm using uh, Mitchell's wool fat soap. I've decided that the canned whatever from the system, as it were, I'm using the Gillette um, Irritation Defense 5 or whatever this is called. And there you go. So, there's a Gillette 5 pass, which is me. <laughs> I mean that. And my soap's looking a little dry, so. So tomorrow what will happen is I will do a three pass shave with the double edge after doing a single pass. Maybe, eh, I don't know. Still don't quite decide how to do this. to cross rinse some water because I've got a little bit of vinegar in that to uh, break the uh, bubbles. Mm -hmm. 
and that way I can just put it right up on camera. However, I thought the concept of... I skipped. I thought the concept of running vinegared water over a shaven face was just not really going to do it for me. I don't know, this could show absolutely no difference. Not that, well, ladies and gentlemen, is why I do this stuff. We here eternally, you know, system X is better than system Y. And not just within wet shaving, I mean, you look at. Uh, Gillette versus Wilkinson versus um, Schick. Everybody claims to have the silver bullet. Of course, being a single pass shave, still not a lot of difference. So, well, let's go. Hoping that would have settled out a little better. And yeah, hmm. That's gonna be a problem. Hmm. Well, let's see. I'm not completely out of ideas here. One clean piece of shop towel. And let's win this out. We may have to wait on this until it dries out. It's not showing up really well on camera, but uh, yeah, there was some debris showing in the bottom of the container. I'm not sure if I got stuff that stayed in there. You can see there's some on the rim there. Okay, so unfortunately. Um, <laughs> and, you know, there's a little bit, little bit showing there. The question is, will it come out on camera? For those of you who have high def, now would probably be a good time to bust it out. So. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to let that dry. I will post a larger uh, quality picture. Yeah, there's actually quite a bit there. I was hoping for a little better result. I'll use a white towel tomorrow, but uh, I can tell you right now that does feel closer. <laughs> yeah, that was the ingrown that I had to fix yesterday. I'm used to getting a little irritation down here. This was a surprise. Anyway, um, I won't say, you know, wow, uh, that's incredible, but it's definitely a result. And like I said, I'll uh, post a more detailed picture of that when I put the video up so you can check that out on uh, Reddit or slash wicked underscore edge. And uh, see you tomorrow for the final comparison. Uh, Till next time, I'm Beetlejuice from Reddit's Wicked Edge. Keep them sharp.